Hello and uh, welcome back to my video. In this video I will continue with the shopping cart in Beautify JS. And today I will show you how you can create a search box on your on your main page. So we prepare to people can search about products in your web shop. To this I will use uh, Parallax and I will use uh, layouts and I will use Flex to place our content around. So let's begin. First we need our parallax. We need a height. I only want to 300. And then we use a dark color and we use a link here from uh, from Beautify uh, JS website. So we can have a test and then we have a background. And then we have a V banner. And now you can see we have uh, this big area. If I'm going back and remove the height, you can see it's getting much bigger here. So we only interesting to have a search area for this. So when you hit the page, I will show the search content here. Let's go back. Uh, yeah. And then we build a V container. We say you should use so much you can field, and then it's a grid list Excel. I will make a space here. So then we build a wheel layout. I'll say justify center. It's meaning it's trying to to make a layout center. And then it should be a row and then a rabbit. I build the first V flex box. I say on small div it should be 12 grids in until you hit a small device. So that's meaning every device should be 12 grid. And then I use style, text, align, center. It's meaning all my text inside, it's centralized. And then I'll build the first one here. Class, display. I want to use display size uh, 3. And then font, weight, thin. And then this one. Let's call it uh, product search. And this is the first one. Product search is done. And then we have a H4 check. Inside here, find what you are using. Class subheading. Then we have two now. The next is we need to build a new flex box because we need the input flex, and this should be twelve two. And inside we, we need a V form and then we need a V text field outline outline label that's meaning what should be stay in, in the search before you you click on it. Search for products. And then I want to append an icon. It should be a search icon. And then close the VTEXT. Now you can see we have a big search here and we're not interested into the big search here. We're only interested to use like uh, 
the half of the screen to the search. So let's go back. If you put inside here uh, a flex box and wrap it around and say XS6 and before this we need a mini layout with the align center, it's meaning the place it's center and then justify center and row wrap what we're doing here it's basically make a layout in a layout but that's how we're fixing it now we can see it's a, a half the screen you can search product search ready here and you can see that the little search here is getting smaller if I remove this it's coming back and we have a little search icon here so that's uh, the video about Parallax layout and flex I hope you enjoy and if you like it, then please subscribe my channel if you have any questions please make a comments below and I hope you enjoy so you subscribe my channel add it to your playlist and share it with your friends see you next time